fighter jet build in blender uh today we're gonna try and model some wings i think they'll be a lot easier than the last one honestly i also need to make a few adjustments to the front here so i was looking earlier and in the images hold on a second there we go in the images there's a bit more of a curve going on here, which I'm not really portraying that well. Uh, so I'm gonna add a cut right there and another one right here. And with that, we can pull these two, I'm thinking these two, no, these two, I'm pulling them in and then I can pull these ones out. There we go. That gets a bit more of that gets a bit more of that sweep that we like to see. Uh, okay, now we're going to move on to the wings. And these I'm hoping are going to be super easy. So I'm going to end them right about there. Okay. So I'm going to go like this. Uh and I'm going to, I think I'm just going to extrude them. I can split them later on if I want. Go like this and scale this down. Okay. Yeah, that looks real good. I'm liking that. Okay, and the back as well. I think the back's a bit harder because if I remember correctly, the whole the whole wing swivels based on that right there, this hinge. So this one, I think I can add in as a separate object. So in F16, I'm going to go object mode, add. I'm just going to add in a plane. I'm going to go back into edit mode, add a mirror modifier. Okay. And then this, I'm going to bring it pretty close here Bring it to the back and then there, and then bring that in, bring it back. Nice, that's looking good. Okay, cut it right there. Bring this in. Okay, I'm I'm liking this. I'm liking this. Okay, this. We're gonna go like that, as well as that. Yeah. I'll just slide that up so it's straight. Same with this one. And then I'm gonna add one more cut right there. Cool. Now we're gonna add some thickness to this because it is just a flat plane. So I'm gonna grab all of it. I'm going to take out the images for a bit here. Go E, bring it up. Okay, and how thick is it? It's fairly thick, so I'm going to add that in. I'm going to bring it up to about there. Okay, and then now I gotta get the shape going here. So for this part, I'm going to bring these down and bring these up. I might balance that out a bit better. OK, 
Okay, and then this one, scale, so Z, S, I think it's the Z axis, yeah. Something like that, looks pretty good. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Okay, and then, now this. Let's scale that up a bit. That. Just getting a bit more shape to it here. back in SZ. Same with that. Perfect. The front's got to come a lot more together too, so SZ. Oh, not wider. SC. Cool. Make that a bit thinner. Same with this. So a scale Z. Thinner as well. Make a little bit wider. Something like that. Yeah, that's cool. Okay, I like that shape. It's pretty good. Um, and it has a bit of a downward slope to it. Just trying to see how it matches up here with this, this jut out part. I'm not too happy with that yet, but I'll, we'll fix that. We'll fix that in a bit. Um, so now, I'll bring this down a bit. Now we gotta work on the slope. Oh gosh, so Z. Select all the vertices, bring it down. And this is the part that might be a bit, oops. Don't want to extrude it, I want to rotate it. Something like that looks pretty good. Or higher up. So our back doesn't quite line up, so I'm actually going to bring this up a bit. That, that looks pretty sweet. The angle looks a bit steep, but it's not quite, this isn't going to be perfect. I don't think, because my, my picture is not quite, not quite 100%. As you can see from the front to the back, It's a little bit off, so yeah, I think I think that's gonna be good. Okay, so the, this is gonna come out. It's gonna swivel right here. So then this is gonna extrude straight across, right to there. Very nice. Okay, and then it's gonna get. That's where our swivel is gonna come from. Cool. I like this. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, now we're gonna move on to the tail. So I'm gonna go back into the collection, object mode. We're gonna add another. Uh, 
Yeah, we're gonna go with the plane. Okay. Rotate. Okay, I'm just gonna focus on one side of this for now. So I'm gonna start right here at the front. I'm gonna pull that right back, actually, right to there. Control surfaces, I'm gonna figure out afterwards. That goes to there, and that goes to there. Actually, I'll move that up. I can just control R and loop cut that afterwards. That'll keep it straighter. Loop cut right here, bring it up to there. Perfect. Then this, nope. Let's look at this edge, press E, bring it back to about here. Slide that back and slide that back. Nice. Cool. And then as far as the whole rotation goes, I'm going to I'm actually just gonna pull oh, mouse. I'm actually just gonna pull this in to there. Yeah. Cool. Put a cut right there. And now I'm going to extrude this down. I'm gonna go straight down. So E. Pull it right down to about there. Yeah. And then this, we're going to go E, pull it forward, and this is just going to come down right like that. Just so it's underneath. Okay, perfect. Z. Extrude again right there. Take the bottom vertices, press E one more time, and bring them straight down again. There we go. Okay, so the bottom of this has to be a bit wider. So this is one part that we have to get. So this is going to go, I might add a loop cut here. Uh, no, I'm just going to pull this up. Go three. press E. So it's going to bring that out a little bit to make that a bit wider. Perfect. I'm liking something like that. Cool. And I missed one. I'm going to try this again. All right. E. that edge I don't know why that's still there and delete it and delete it cool it's not going to bring the end in a little bit and the back out cool so this is going to go press three and then we're going to extrude this straight back to about there. I don't need 
that face anymore. Perfect. And this, I'm going to taper it in a little bit. So I'm going to taper it. Yeah, I'm going to taper it starting maybe here. And in the front, get rid of the references. That's going to taper in. I'm going to add a modifier to this mirror. Very nice. OK. I don't know why I'm getting extra cuts here. I'm just going to go. I know there's an easier way to do this, but I don't know what the shortcut is for it. So I'm just going to go into object mode, weld, apply. There we go. Now that's gone. Now I can press Z, Alt that, Alt. So Alt grabs the whole edge of this thing. Now I can add clipping and press E and bring it straight in. Beautiful. Very nice. Cool. Now I'm going to drag this back, I think. Nope. That doesn't quite work. Here's what I'm going to do. Pull this in. There we go. Very nice. going to fill this in. OK, I'll have to fix this up. Actually, I think I'm going to do that right now. I'm just going to loop cut this. Bring it up. And then I'll bring this. Good, okay, so delete one fill fill merge at last. Actually. Retry that. Okay, so I wanted to pull that out right there to this, and this can get deleted. Delete. Okay, so two, one, fill. Delete that. Fill and perfect. Fill. I think that's what I was trying to do. Something like that. Cool. This is starting to come together. Images. Yeah, I'm liking this. I might pull the bottom down a bit more. Ah, no, I'll wait for now. Okay. Now we'll just add some control surfaces in. So there's a loop cut right here. Yeah, let's 
looks like there. Uh, three. Then this is going to extrude straight back. So E. I'll do about there. And bring that to about there. Perfect. Also, this is going to get much smaller. So scale on the Z axis, bring it down. Nice. Cool. Then control surfaces. So th what I'm going to do here, I'm just going to bring this right in. So I'm going to duplicate this, I believe. Yeah. Bring it in. Press E. I'm going to bring it all the way back to about here. And there. Perfect, and this has to get bigger now. So this will scale up to match that. Still have to figure out how to fill that in. I'm not sure what that's supposed to be. I'll have to research that a little bit. Same with this, I'll have to figure out my control surfaces a little better. Um, and then here, we're gonna go three. Shift D, move it out and up. Okay, and let's pull that straight back to about there. Pull that to there. that way in. Same with this one. Oh. Perfect. All right, let's take a look at this. I think that is looking sweet. Cool. Let me know what you think down in the comments. Uh, and if you see anything that needs improvement so far, let me know. Uh, and yeah, hopefully I can get that fixed in the next one. Um, next, we're going to move on to the canopy. And then also I'm going to fix some of these, whatever these are, these hinges here and then this hole right here. I'm not sure what goes there. So yeah, we'll get that in the next episode. All right. Thank you for watching.